All right, good afternoon. Today is March 8th, Thursday, March 8th, the day after my birthday. And I just wanted to touch base I about what I ate today so far. I've had a dragon fruit and a half, basically. And I'm a little bit hungry. I'm having kind of like a little bit of a headache and I'm feeling tired. I don't think I slept very well last night, so I don't know. We'll have to see. So I'm gonna have a Kent mango right now because I'm like a little, like I'm feeling hungry, but I also feel like things are moving. And you know, I'm, I'm eating some cooked food, so that might be um, a little bit intense for my body. But I mean, I don't feel like totally bad. I haven't really had anything to drink and I did a workout too, so I don't know if that's part of it or you know. But I haven't had any water since Octu mid-October, like October 13th I think it was. So I bought some coconuts. I found some at a grocery store and I bought some coconuts. So I might have a coconut and some Kent mango. And then we'll see how I feel. Cause I am really wanting to eat some more potatoes. They were like really comforting for me. So we'll see. I'll keep you posted on that. But I just wanted to touch base about the dragon fruit that I ate. I ate uh, one and a half about while I was, when I was working, so. Okay, so I had the dragon fruit and a half. And then when I got home, I made myself a salad, and I had some of the mashed potatoes that I made last night with some peppers and onion, and I put that on top of a rucola with cucumber, and I had some dill sauerkraut. And it was really, really good, and then I had another serving of the potatoes, and it was really good. But now I'm feeling hungry again, so I made myself a like smoothie bowl thing. So it was just a banana, two bananas, a package of frozen raspberries and barley grass juice powder, and spirulina. So that's what I'm eating now. I just wanted to touch base with you about what I've been eating. I also had two coconuts in addition to everything else. And I did have a little bit of a breakdown because I get so confused sometimes what I think is healthy, what I don't think is healthy, who I should listen to. And so I had a little bit of a breakdown just now with Andrew and he was here supporting me, which was really, really nice. And I really appreciated it. And yeah, so that's what's been happening with me. And I really want something kind of sweet. So I'm having this movie bowl right now and I'm really excited to eat it. I had a smoothie bowl. I think that was the last thing I said. I'm not sure. I yeah, I had a smoothie bowl, but it looked really brown because I had it was raspberry banana, spirulina, and barley gosh juice powder. And then I started to make some potatoes for some lunch tomorrow. And instead, I started to eat some of them. I had a homemade ketchup that I made a while back and some yellow mustard, so I put that on them. I was gonna make the medical medium dish and I just haven't gotten a chance to. And they smelled so good, the potatoes, that I had to eat them. But I obviously didn't finish all of them, at least not yet, but it's like really late, so I probably need to stop eating at this point because I need to go to bed soon so that I can wake up early and do my Shana Virtue workout. Anyway, I just thought I would share that with you. I like literally can't stop eating, but it's okay. I'm embracing it. At least I'm working on it. Today was a little bit difficult. There were some tears that were shed. Andrew helped me through it. I just like struggle, but you know, I'm loving myself. I gotta learn, I'm learning. I'm learning to be compassionate with myself and loving towards myself. And yeah, so that's something that I'm working on. So anyway. Thought I'd share that with you. Today's day 35, I think, since breaking my 108 day fast. But anyway. Anyway, that's something that I wanted to share, you know. That's Andrew saying some numbers, because like, he's doing like important things that are helpful in our life. He's over there. I don't know if you can see him. He's there. It's not just me all the time in the house, just so you know. Andrew is here sometimes too. And also we're working on getting our logo made, which is great. So we'll see. Stay tuned. Good night.